A 60 meter cable is cut into two pieces. One piece is twice as long as the other piece. Determine the length of each piece of cable A by graphing and B with substitution. Before we can solve this question using either method, we need to obtain a system of equations. When the cable is cut into two pieces, we should give each piece a name. We'll call the long piece Y and the short piece X. We know the length of the original cable is 60 meters, so the lengths of the cut pieces must add up to 60 meters too. Our first equation is X plus Y equals 60. Since the question tells us that the long piece is twice as long as the short piece, we can write this as y equals 2x. This is our second equation. We'll now complete part A, which asks us to solve the system of equations graphically. The first equation needs to be rewritten in slope-intercept form so we can graph it. We're now ready to draw the graphs. First we'll draw the graph of y equals minus x plus 60. Next we'll draw the graph of y equals 2x. The point of intersection is the ordered pair 20-40. X is a short piece and it has a length of 20 meters. Y is the long piece and it has a length of 40 meters. Moving on to part B, we'll solve this system using substitution. We already know both equations in our system, y equals 2x and y equals minus x plus 60. We will now perform a substitution by plugging in 2x for y in the second equation. Now we'll solve the equation 2x equals minus x plus 60 for x. Bring minus x to the left side to get 3x equals 60. Divide both sides by 3 to isolate x, which is 20. We now have the x value of the point of intersection, but we still need the y value. In order to get the y value, we must plug x into either of the original equations. Using the first equation, we'll plug in 20 for x. Minus 20 plus 60 gives 40. The y value at the point of intersection is 40. If we used y equals 2x instead, we would have got the same result. Solving graphically and solving with substitution will always give you the same ordered pair as your final answer.